Good morning, Leo. Welcome to your reading. Let's see what we have for you today. What does the angels and spirit guides have to say to the sign of Leo, please, at this time? What does the sign of Leo need to know at this time, please? Hierophant. Mm, disappointing connection there. I feel you're trying to turn your back on it. There's a load of regrets there. It didn't. It's not working out for you. I feel you're struggling to walk away from it. Mm. You're concentrating on your work. There's a decision here that you've been hanging on to but not actually making. Some of you perhaps think that you can work it out. Some of you think there's no hope. So I feel that you're remaining indecisive at the moment. That's part of the challenge, actually making this decision. Yeah. King of Swords. Perhaps for some of you, there's a divorce here. But things are in limbo and you're, you want to leave it and you're waiting on a decision from the courts or from a legal office. Mm. An offer coming in back in from the past. Mm. This King of Swords, you could be dealing with an Aquarius Libra Gemini. But there's somebody been very indecisive and now there's an offer coming in. But you see it as toxic and you certainly don't want to jump into a repetitive cycle. It's, it's, I'm picking up it's a very demanding connection here. person you're dealing with at all costs there. Kind of be a bit sneaky about the way they approach. They're trying to avoid confrontation. You're looking for much a deeper connection. Something that gives you a lot more joy, a lot more sp spiritual and emotional satisfaction. But I feel some of you are, are trying to you, trying to leave this connection. There's communication coming in in the future, in the near future. Fast communication. Perhaps this these answers you've been waiting for from the legal authorities, whatever it is. You know, with these legal issues. But I do see movement in the near future. Could be travel here. This communication will put in your path, your life path, a very serious decision to be made. And within this decision, there's truth. And trust. Yeah, throwing yourself into work. Throwing yourself into getting stable. Mm. So the person you're dealing with is at this moment, you know, just holding back, resting. They're exhausted. They could have been working too hard. But they are approaching you with this offer. I feel they're waiting for the right opportunity. They, like I say, they're strategizing on how to approach. Mm. You're undergoing a huge transformation though. But if you decide to pursue this, you know, after an ending, there's a new beginning and a new emergence. Hmm. Five of Cups. As I say, there's a lot of disappointment in this. The person you're dealing with is very disappointed. They're, they're struggling to move on. They are. I feel they're in a dilemma. They're 
their responsibilities not only lie with this connection with you, they, they lie somewhere else. But yeah, it's, it's definitely just being kept in limbo at the moment. Hangman. There's a connection here that, you know, you've got to decide on whether to pursue it or let go of it. So it's fraught with challenges. And as I say, for some of you, there's you've blocked them, they've blocked you. There's barriers between you. This person is very, very independent. Three of Cups. Mm. For some of you, there's distance involved, travelling to another country, and then all sorts of legal issues apply then. This is part of the challenge. Mm. Somebody here is getting impatient. It's all a question of following your true heart's desire. But in the past there was a lot of drama around this. Yeah. The devil. There's, a, there's an obsession here of some kind, some obsessive thinking. It could even be a soulmate you're dealing with. But... Yeah, there's a lot of delays and this feeling of trap, trapped, being trapped. And you're trying to figure out a way of going forward without repeating a past cycle. You're certainly very, very reluctant. You want to you walk away from the toxicity, that's for sure. Yeah, Ace of Cups, new love coming in. from a distance I'm picking up a travel for some of you yeah waiting yeah end of a burdensome cycle with this person they're resting because they're exhausted I feel so are you. Like I say, this person you're dealing with, perhaps they've got other responsibilities, a sick parent or they're a carer, their job is very, very demanding. And they're just taking time out to rest. You've got the Ace of Swords here. Finally a decision to move on. Bring in the changes that's necessary. Sagittarius energy, fire energy, bringing in balance. You got a tower moment here. I feel somebody, a tower moment in the Queen of Cups, somebody here is going to realise exactly what it is they feel. Yeah, three of wands. Yeah, there's, there's, there's some indecision here. There's some definite indecision here on, you know, on a love connection. Whether this is you or them. I feel it's a bit of you both. You both kind of want it, but both won't make the decision to go for it. So it's, it's a bit of a stalemate. And there's some healing here. And I feel neither of you wants to make the first move. That's for some of you. And then, as I say, some of you, the person you're dealing with is, is kind of trapped in a cycle. They can't, they find it very, very difficult to get out of it. And of course, it's everything's in limbo. I hope that's helped. Thank you very much for watching.